Okay guys, here is the final update for you. <laughs> I'll tell you I did meet my goals, all of them. And I'll explain the deals that I've got here. Right here, I have the Lysol no-touch pumps. I have to call my uncle, make sure it's okay to use his address to get the third rebate. I know it will be, he's awesome. I have three boxes there. Got all three, I will get the full money back. The coupons are no longer available to print, so it's totally on the up and up. I have separate receipts. Now, the Schick Hydro from Hell. Oh my gravy. Okay. I had big issues with Walmart today. They didn't want to let me purchase more than one. The cashier went just to double check the coupon and it should have been fine because it was a basic PDF printable. Anybody could have printed off as many as they wanted. But mine were in black and white and they decided mine were copies. So the center manager, or sorry, the CSM came and she said, no, you can't do that. And I said, okay, can you please get me a manager? She said, I am a manager. I said, no, a store manager. And she went and got the assistant manager who said, no, you can't use these. I said, yes, I can. They're completely legit coupons here. So she said, I'm going to go ask my person that handles the cash in the back and then they said no. I said okay I'm going from here over to that phone right there and I'm calling head of office because I did it from their pay phone because it's a 1-800 number I could do it for free without running up my cell phone. Saving money is a goal. I phoned the head office. The head office said okay the coupon has to say manufacturer coupon it has to have a Canadian address and it has to have an expiry date had all of these things so I went they said okay go to the front go to customer service and talk to the manager they'll put it through they may put a limit on it and I said that's fine I have no trouble with the limits they let me put through all ten okay I had to put them through one at a time I have right now three receipts for the Lysol one with the Hydra Silk and I have a total of a dozen receipts. I'm going to enter every single one for the freebie. It's not always easy to coupon and get this stuff free. The scissors? Yeah, I forgot my scissors. I had to buy a new pair, so the pretty red ones will be my price cutters. Yeah. <laughs> that was a hard deal. I really want to thank the lady that did find them. I popped them open. I want to show you the coupon inside. One is got a little USA flag and one has a Canadian flag and it is for the refill packs so it won't get you more of these but it will help you get a refill especially if you're in a place that can stack coupons on two I'm going to give you the short one first right here see this guy the two items the herbal essence and the bar of soap Olay soap was on sale at Giant Tiger so around there to go get it after I was done with Walmart I went to No Frills, or not No Frills, to um, Giant Tiger because I have to use my coupons up for the end of the month. There's only one day left. Well, <laughs> there was one bar of soap left so my buy to get three dollar coupon was not going to work. However, buy two brands, get $4 off, paid for those two, and I paid 20 cents. That's it. Tax for those. This was an amazing deal. Do you see that red sticker? I love red stickers. Well, Target has a deal. When you buy two fructis, you get a $5 gift card back. And those red stickers are 91 cents each. I bet you're doing that math right now. It worked out that I spent, it was a really horrible transaction for the lady that worked there. There's probably a mess up on it. But it worked out that I paid $30.05 and, and I got a $30 gift card back that I can roll into offers later. And I got six shampoo, six conditioners, 
the Neutrogena Facial Wipes, Eggs, and Cheese. That is so awesome. I'm really, really happy with this. And up next, I'm going to give you a breakdown of everything I got and then my total so you'll know how well I did in a month. And I am tired. i got to tell you, I'm really tired. That was a lot of work. Um, my hip has been popping in and out of joint, so... <laughs> It wasn't the fun shopping day for me. It was very painful. I was not. I was cranky when I was dealing with the Walmart people. And I got to say, Walmart, who's normally really good with coupons, sucked royal bonkers today. They just did. Target is always amazing. This lady, I'm going to say it's at the four salon location that I went to today. She is a manager or something there. She's just amazing. She sticks it out and helps figure out these horrible transactions because this one was, it messed with their computer. If you can find this deal, go for it, but it's going to mess with their computer and you best to be waiting for a long checkout time. And Giant Tiger is kind of known for being crappy with the coupons sometimes. I've had a lot of trouble with them. No problem today. Straight in straight out the best customer service there was a great lady in there who I'm going to because she stopped everything she was doing she ran to check in the back to see if there was more Olay soap for me so I'm going to put in a nice comment to Giant Tiger about her because she was very friendly very personable and approachable and helpful it was really awesome to see that okay now on to the breakdown of what I got Okay, it's time for the breakdown. Now, I'm going to tell you this off the get-go. I picked the worst month of the year to be couponing in. This is what we call the summer drought. That means that last month there were hardly any coupons in the stores, and this month as well. So, you're fighting a losing game, and it is the hardest time of year to have attempted this, and I did it anyway. And... This is what I've got this month. I got 22 Marcel makeup products. It was blush and lip gloss. And they're really nice. It was two different types of blush. 12 Crest 3D toothpaste. 6 Oral-B toothbrushes. 3 6 packs of sponge towels, paper towels. 3 12 packs of double roll bathroom tissue, three Scotty's tissue, four, four kilograms of Red Pass sugar. Yeah, it's cane sugar, so I'm really happy about that. I don't always get the opportunity to get it that cheap. Two Old El Paso taco kits. I got those free. Two six packs of 710 mil Pepsis. They were $2 each. That was a great deal. One Kraft barbecue sauce, one lemon pepper spice mix, you know, just in the little plastic bag that you can get at the store. Four of the cheap Glade aerosol sprays, two Glade plugins. I only used two Zantac this month. I have lots more to use, <laughs> and I will be using them. Five secret deodorants. They were free. Seven Melita coffee. Nine Gotta Be Hair Care products. I got four more things of sugar. I can. I use just a crazy amount when I'm canning. Um, last time I was canning with mom and I didn't bring vinegar, but I brought tons of sugar. So we just used my sugar and her vinegar. No big deal. And where was I? Was that sugar? I got a package of cheddar cheese. That was a 500 gram and it was real cheddar. 
one lactose-free milk, two Febreze air freshener sprays, one box of 18 potato chips, they're the small little bags, three Olay body washes, three Old Spice body washes, four Good Host iced tea powder, one Good Host lemonade powder, three packs of granola bars, two boxes of Quaker oatmeal, two Tropicana juices, one Tic Tac, two bags of Doritos, two bags of Tostitos, two, uh, sorry, four two liters of Pepsi, two two liters of Mountain Dew, those were all free, one Chapman's ice cream, and that's like the drumsticks, it was really good, three Lysol no touch pumps, that's the soap dispenser, and I showed you all of these guys, that's the 10 chick razors, the scissors, <laughs> the shampoo, conditioner, Neutrogena face wipes, one black diamond cheese, one dozen eggs, one herbal, es uh, herbal essence conditioner, and that is got to be changed to just the oil, oil of a bottle of soap. And give me a second, I'll scroll down. Okay, here we go. How's this for a shelf cost? If you were just to go in the store and go grocery shopping, that's what you would have paid. $1,124.22. Yeah, store discounts was more than half, and that's almost always the case. Then the coupons, $340.56. I really count the rebates in as my coupons, and I was hoping to hit that $400 total, and I did it with the combination of the two. My cash out of pocket, this is how much I actually spent, one ninety two sixty one. Yeah, that's a fair chunk of change for me. That's pretty big. But I'm getting one oh four sixty one of that back in rebates. I'm getting back more than half of what I spent. That's just amazing. And the amount I ended up paying after rebates and everything is eighty seven ninety two. Yeah, now here's the thing. I did have to put this money out, but I can roll this money from now on. And you have to get it started and you have to get it rolling at some point. I will use my Target gift card to help me get more stuff later, and that will n reduce it so I won't have cash out of pocket again. You have to get it rolling at some point. It's kind of like a buy in. This was not an easy task to do this. It took effort. And the biggest obstacle, honestly, was the Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome because when my hip pops out, it pops out. And I really had to push myself way harder than I should have today. <laughs> but I wanted to get it done so that you could see what could be done. I realistically think that people could do this and work a full-time job. You just can't if you have this illness. It, well, pardon me, this syndrome. It does make it harder to do everything. I only went out on my good days. I took a week off over the month and this is just an amazing total to come to. Not only did I come to this total, I was scared with how much I was spending this month and I was nowhere near this at that point. It was like the last time I did a whole bunch of rebates in this one and I'm really happy I did but yeah I was nervous about how much I spent so I stayed with cash in hand and I stayed the heck away from my bank account I didn't look I didn't peek I didn't really guess I just stayed away from it if I needed a little bit of gas in the van I put it in but I tried not to use my card one week before payday at the end of the month. I only get paid once a month. I still had $187 left in my account. That is huge. I don't get a big check. All of this work that I did paid off in cash at the end of the month because I was watching and so much more aware of what I was spending that I watched everything and we had 
mine and my daughter's birthday, we went out and ate twice for that, plus one more time in the month. And we each, I spent $50 on each of us for our birthdays. It was an expensive month. And I still came through okay at the end. I really want to thank that person who sent me the coupons. I'm not asking for more, but it did inspire me to really try harder and it really paid off in cash and that's kind of awesome and if you're a couponer I really really recommend you use this savings tracker I recommend you try it you don't have to do it all year long but I recommend you try it for a month because what will happen in the end is you're going to be a better couponer I had a hundred and thirty dollars difference at the end of the month compared to what I normally have. I normally have about 50 bucks left at the end of the month. So that's a huge increase. And it's a small family, so it could be even better for people who have larger families. So give it a try. Think about it. It's worth doing for just one month to see the savings. And especially it's back to school and Christmas is coming. If you did this up until Christmas, you could pay for your Christmas. I hope you have a great day. I'm so happy that I did it. I'm so happy that I saved the amount I did. And I stocked right back up from the donations that I gave. I have a little bit less bars of soap, but you can't do anything about it when they run out at the stores where you're trying to buy. So. It's all good. I did okay. And I hope you get some great savings and that you can apply them to things that really make you happy. Have a great day. Bye.